update tonight on former Colorado Springs police officer and hometown hero Jim Giselle. After years of recovery and rehab, he is able to move back to Colorado Springs. Our Bill Folsom is here with an update of what's happening. Bill. Yeah, officer Giselle was shot in the head while on duty nearly four years ago. Since then, he's been on a long path to recovery. Words gotten out. He's moving back. It's prompted a community show of support and appreciation. Officer Jim Duzell shot in the head while confronting a gunman. His life in question for days turned to months in the hospital and years of rehab. Now, an exciting milestone. He's coming home in seven days. His now fiance, Lane Packle, has remained in Colorado Springs. Since the dark day of the shooting in 2018, she says this community has been like family. So the community is already coming around, wrapping their arms around both Jem and Lane, and it's very exciting for us to be a part of it. The couple is humbled and inspired by an offer from the Police Foundation to collect donations to pay for their upcoming wedding and honeymoon. It meant the world. It just means that everything's kind of coming to a head. It's been, we've been waiting for so long to make Colorado Springs our home again. Head partially shaved and scar showing, Duzell led a procession of officers at the Medal of Valor Awards in 2019. The same people who honored him that day support the Welcome Home Plan. They will always be an important part of the CSPD family and we will always be here for them. Life will never be the same as before the shooting. Still, his fiance says the return to Colorado Springs is a symbol of normalcy. Oh, he's phenomenal. Yeah, he's so good. And Duzell's been in New York getting support from his family until now, and he wants to get back and call Colorado Springs home. His fiance is the main reason, but he is also very close to many friends with Colorado Springs Police. We'll put a link to the Police Foundation of Colorado Springs wedding support effort on KOAA.com.